What's up guys, Juice Messi here and welcome to a brand new video. Welcome to that time of the week again where we've got Foot Champions Weekly Rewards. It's Thursday at 6pm. We've got a lot of really cool Team of the Week players to potentially pack as well as a lot of colourful cards like Man of Matches. But I'll get into those in more detail in just a second. So before we get started, as always, if you can show your support by leaving a like rating, that'd be absolutely awesome. If you're new to my channel, click the subscribe button for daily FIFA content and the comments below. How many wins did you get this week? And finally, if you missed my previous video, it was down below in the description box. Right, so first up, let's take a look at Team of the Week and the in particular players I wouldn't mind getting. So first up, a Pishek in form. I kind of need him for the weekend coming up right now because he plays in the Bundesliga. I've got a full Bundesliga team. That's what I'll be rocking. And Pishek, definitely the best right back in that league. Then we've got a second form, Dante. The left back, this guy, uh, Juanme Costa. He looks really solid and very cheap. We've got a walkout 88 rated Isco. Looks like a fantastic little centre midfielder. And uh, we've got Talisa. Look how well-rounded this card is, by the way. Unreal stats after his upgrade. Then we have got a uh, the other Titch right there who's 84 rated. Who's wants to watch card. Klaassen, a third informed Dybala. 89 rated with a fantastic dynamic image. And two strikers, Hernandez. Probably the best dynamic image of the lot. And finally, an 86 rated Kevin Gamero for his uh, like five minute hat trick or whatever it was. For Atletico Madrid, looks like a great card and holding some very good value. On the bench, we've got Carrasco, Julian, uh, Brooks, Hernandez, Valdez, Insignia, 87, and a Defrel. But also in the packs alongside the informs, we've got upgrade cards from the Premier League, uh, Liga, and Calcet, and now the La Liga. Also on top of that, we have got Man of Match cards, Harry Kane, Cesc Fabregas, and that Cam Mkhitaryan. And finally, I also think there are European Man of Matches still about, but I could well be wrong on that one. So as you can see, we claimed our awards and we got gold one this week. I was one win off uh, getting elite, which really annoys me because my target every single week is to hit 29 wins minimum. I got 28 again, the second time I've done that. And so far out of seven weekend leagues I've played, I've managed to get five elites and two gold ones. I mean, gold one is still decent. I mean, if I press A one more time, uh, the rewards we do get, two 100k packs and 50k, it's not bad whatsoever. And the last game I lost to miss out on getting elite for the week was in fact on penalties, which made it a little bit harder to take. But either way, press A one more time, get our coins right in. And I'll show you my record. So I think now, um, yeah, 28 out of 40 is still okay, especially after the Sunday. A Sunday, I was playing God Awful. That's the complete reason I missed out uh, on getting elite this week. But if I change it to monthly leaderboards, we've got 89 wins out of 120 games, 40 games left. But now we only need eight wins to get ourselves elite and 12 special red cards. And I'm not gonna lie, I'm pretty sure this weekend I'm gonna get the eight wins I need and just completely stop playing. I'm gonna have a weekend off, uh, get myself elite monthly, and starting in next month for March. So my 100k pack last week was absolutely awful. I got a Viviano pop up, which is an like 82 rated goalkeeper, and my elite pack was at three 81s at the possible four. So hopefully this week it's much much kinder to me. So very first pack, 24 items, 24 gold, 24 rares. Press A and see what we get. Hopefully a walkout player. Press A. What we can get? Is it a walkout? I don't think that's a walkout. The flare, it's not the worst. Okay, right back, who is that? That's an upgrade Carver how he's 84 rate. That's not too bad, actually. Probably got some kind of value right now. Press A to skip and see what else we get inside the pack. So then, what are we looking at? Patricio got 384 rated players. Not the greatest, but I mean, they are some kind of value in potential uh, future SBC. So we'll keep all these players. I'll actually check Carver House price quickly. Um, well, it eventually loads. There we go. His price is probably quite high right now because of the uh, obviously the weekend league requirements. So compare price, uh, 20,000 quid max and 18k. Okay, he's be quite cheap. I'll keep him in my club anyway for future uh, SBCs or whatever. Motta, Evra, Wilshire, Albiol, Castro, and Donnarumma. Um, there's a couple of upgrades there actually. We'll send those to my club. We also got on Q, Blind, Lemos. Uh, Tossage. I don't think there's any upgrades here that I can kind of think of. Uh, Cyprian, actually. This guy is unreal. And I think he's got some kind of value because his, his stats are crazy. But I'm pretty sure there's no one else of any kind of value. I've checked a couple of them here and there. Uh, but what we'll do is discard the rest for 8,000 coins. So not the best of first packs, but much better than last week's 100k pack. And 100k pack number two. Can we get a special card or a walkout player? Let's find out. So press A. What have we got to deal with? No walkout. What flare we got? Oh, God. Ugh. That's Masaccio. 83. Like, it's so bad. I know I should really complain because it's like a free pack or whatever, but... Ugh, Schmeier's like a downgrade. Lovren, Ganso, Suzo upgrade, Lamar upgrade, a Zaha upgrade, Alonso upgrade, and also Danny Simpson upgrade. And we also got Karius with his new pitches. So overall, not fantastic rewards again. Um, a few players that could sell for a little bit here and there, but we'll send my club anyway. Um, because like marquee matchups, these players, 
they're all coming useful at some stage. And just before we wrap the video up, as you can see, a Team of the Year card has been upgraded now, and that is Gerard Piquet from a 94, I believe, to a 95, but a 70 pace, whatever it was, to 74. Before that, of course, he was still a very, very good card, but now I think he'll feature a lot in this weekend league for La Liga and the Bundesliga. But anyway, guys, that is going to be the end of the video. If you enjoyed it, show support by leaving a like rating. That'd be absolutely awesome. If you're new to my channel, click the subscribe button for daily FIFA content and the comments below. How many wins did you get this week? Are you happy with it? Or are you hoping to get a few more? And finally, if you missed my previous video, it's down below in the description box. So thank you for watching this video and I'll see you next time.